What's happening, you wonderful people on the world wide web? Welcome to the I Paint Creatures YouTube channel. They also call me IPC. And today I'm showing you a bunch of my creatures out of the box. I have a vivid imagination, I like to express it. But once in a while, I need to get out that graphite pen and rub it all over the page and kind of go outside the box to kind of create some creatures that have never been seen from the imaginary realm in this world. But today I wanted to talk to you about a, a quote by Robert Rauschenberg. And Robert says, an empty canvas is full. And how I apply that to my life is, life is an empty canvas. Each day is an empty canvas. Every time you lay your head down to rest, you're resetting everything. And you can call on the law of forgiveness. And take all the mistakes you might have made in your unconsciousness. And not have to live any of those consequences. And I'm talking about like taking your own hand and living under grace and not karmic law. So life is an empty canvas. Every day is an empty canvas. And how you know that it's full? You think from inside your mental faculties, your imagination, your wonder, your creativity. Go beyond all of your limiting thoughts to get rid of your lack and your limitation. You know, and start to see what you see. Like this creature right here. I just uh, visualize in my head and, and then a lot of it is just getting the, the paint and the, I'm using the Posca markers, or not the Posca, the Molotol uh, paint markers. And a lot of it is just observing, you know, like one of my uh, haiku mentors, short poem mentors said a lot of incredible art, especially when it's introspective, it's coming from your imagination, you're bringing forth your originality. Um, you have to follow somewhat of the fundamental rules. And so the world recognizes what it is and you have joy in what you created. And I look at life just like a blank canvas like that, you know? Just start laying down some lines and start to see what it looks like and, you know, put as much symmetry as you can find inside yourself and balance it. But you know what makes it interesting is the uniqueness and, and where you thought you might make a mistake. Stop thinking you're making a mistake. Stop thinking from. Stop asking why and what and how. And bring out the who. And that's how I meet these creatures on the canvases. Just like I do in everyday life. You can apply creativity to everything in your way. Bring forth your own source. Your own imagination. And the canvas is full. So some of the greatest artists. Some of the greatest entrepreneurs. Some of the greatest thinkers that I run into daily now. On this incredible internet that connects us all across lines. And... Um, all across our isms, you know, and makes it into a place where we can really shine if, uh, you know, you convince yourself and get rid of all the layers that have been stacked on your images from society and social institutions and find yourself again. And of course, the best way to do that from an eye paint creature's perspective is the humanity, the arts. You know, bring forth your originality, experiment, get outside that box. And sometimes you might see things that you don't like. But that's what's so great about art. You know, it's a lot like sculpting clay. Remove some stuff. You know, go over some stuff. Add some more dimensions, depths. And I'm not just talking about creative writing or poetry or painting or drawing. I'm talking about the canvas of life. Of every day you can shape it, reshape it. And, uh... As long as you give enough self-love to yourself, take care of yourself, you got another day and a, another sunrise and another field of opportunity to walk into. So treat everything as a blank canvas, you know, and fill it in with your imagination. Think from the beyond. Go past the end of where you really want to be, where you desire. You know, find your purpose along the way so you get in that what I like to call that funky groove. Just like in the wards of George Clinton and Parliament Funkadelic, 
you know, strutting that, that funky style is also removing the funk. Any ails, any obstacles, any limitations, any consciousness of lack, and, you know, think health, think beyond. Fill that canvas with beauty, color, texture, and most of all, your vision. Go out and live for a living. Right on. Thank you very much. Hit the sub. Leave some comments. And let's interact as a community. And let's rise. Because an empty canvas is full in your imagination. Peace.